what is co- playing for Zimmer like, Kyle? It's awesome. Uh, I've had the good fortune to play for a lot of really good head coaches in my career. And, um, you know, Coach Zimmer is one that, you know, people will say all the time, I would run through a wall for this person. And, you know, you, you kind of take it with a grain of salt. But uh, when I say that about Coach Zimmer, it's, it's true because uh, you would do it as if there was something on the other side that you had to have. You know, you wouldn't just run through the wall because he said so. You, you know, you truly believe that he has your best interest in mind. Yeah, I, I, I work with uh, Michael Irvin, Deion Sanders. Uh, they know him from his Dallas days, and they would say all the time when he was looking for a job or when he was not looking for one, when he was interviewing for a head coaching job and got passed over over and over again that people were missing out and that they said the same, they said the same exact thing, Kyle, that they would run through a wall for the guy. And I'm wondering if there's a specific example that you could give uh, to, the, to the fan base here, to the listeners and viewers of the show, as to when that moment you realized that with, with Coach Zimmer? Well, I think just one of the biggest things, obviously I'm from Cincinnati, so uh, I had a little bit of background information from Coach Zimmer when he came up here from the Bengals, and just everyone in the city of Cincinnati was so disappointed that they were losing Coach Zimmer. And then when he got here and I had an opportunity to play for him for a few years, he just, you know, like I said, it seems like he always has your best interest in mind. Now, he's, he's going to be the first one to, to call you out when you do something wrong. Uh, but at the same time, you know, when you buy into his philosophy and you do things the way that he wants it done, he's going to be the first one to pass you on the back as well. 